Today, we're gonna to go over the easiest way to update your AU car unit. The first thing you wanna do is reach out to the company and get them to send the software update straight to your email. Now swipe down from the top left and make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi. Have a way to access your email on the unit. If you have a Gmail account, you can just use the app right here on the screen. Find the email from AU car, click on the link they send you, and then hit direct download. Click no thanks, start the download. Once it starts, select details, and as soon as you see it finishes, back out to the main screen. Open your apps in the lower corner and select eSuperfile. Select internal storage, downloads, hold down the update file to select it, and then in the bottom left-hand corner, select copy. Hit the back arrow and then select paste in the bottom left-hand corner. It will now copy to your local drive. As soon as it finishes, swipe down in the upper right-hand corner and reboot the system. Once the system boots back up, you should get a prompt to start the update. Click upgrade and then select OK to apply the update. Once complete, the system will automatically restart, but there's one more thing to do. You will notice the upgrade prompt will pop up again, so we need to remove the update file. Click back on the app screen, eSuper file, internal storage, hold down the upgrade file, and at the bottom middle of the screen, click on delete and OK. Once deleted, you will no longer get the upgrade prompt. You should now be up to date and good to go. I hope this helps and thanks for watching.